sad, but it's so true. Are we having fun yet? Goat Popovich has spoken. He says DeJounte Murray will not be an all-star. Unfortunately, I agree with him. So we see here DeJounte Murray probably won't be an all-star because of our record. And I completely agree with him. And as you can see here, as I said before, DeJounte had an all-star season. But he's not going to get looked at the all-star game probably. Oh, excuse me. Oh, my goodness. Get a look at the All-Star game probably because our record is so poor. And Coach Popovich is just being honest. He's always been pretty honest with just the situation with the team. Unfortunately, I thought that hopefully the, the coaching staff could see this as an opportunity for us to possibly make any type of run going into this season. But as you know, even with our boy Steve Kerr, he came out and he basically said, yeah, Greg Popovich knows that his team can't do anything this season. And that was far before the season even started. So this, I, I feel like even though the coaches aren't saying it, obviously they're going to try to win. They're going to do their job to the best of their ability. But at the same time, they do understand that this is a conventional, well, maybe not so conventional tank. Uh, but with that being said, let's do talk about DeJounte Murray because sometimes I've been known as a DeJounte Murray hater and i'm not a dejounte murray hater whatsoever i actually think that he is a good player he's gotten much better around this range around 2018 uh 2019 i would say i was kind of one of the guys that were saying i don't know i like Derek white as the point guard primarily but dejounte murray over the years giving him credit he has gotten better and better and better and unfortunately where he's at right now when you have such a poor record you're going to have to probably average over 21, 22 points a game for them to even take a look at you. As Popovich said, the record is already going to hurt you. So just overall, just looking at it, man, he went from 8 to 11 to basically almost 16 to 19. Now, will he get to that 20 mark? I don't know. But you know what? It doesn't matter because as you can see here, he's he's averaging nearly a triple-double. Um, look, the guys that they have on the list thus far, I know people have said, well, it's only, you know, some percentage of the fans, you know, it's only 50%. You also have, you know, the, the players that's going to say something and the coaches are going to vote. Look, he's not going to be an all-star. Even though this record or these these stats, not record, this these stats are so phenomenal, that record is just too ugly. So the two steals, the 19 points, the, the nearly nine assists, the eight rebounds, it's not going to matter. I, I think that oftentimes when we look at all-stars, it's not necessarily based on just the fact that they're close to superstar stardom or they're, you know, big stars. Sometimes it is a little bit of popularity. Sometimes it is a little bit of uh, just circumstance in which they're already a good player and they just happen to be on a good team. And that's just the reality of the situation. I mean, we have Manu Ginobili, who, in my opinion, could have been an all-star almost every game game he played i mean every season he played he, he could have been all-star that's just my take but overall you know that mono ginobili had barely any all-star appearances and that's with the spurs winning 50 plus games every season okay so if if mono ginobili one of the greats can barely get in there when you're a san antonio spur you're gonna have to be near flawless and you're gonna have to have the record to go with it and unfortunately with dejounte murray that's just not going to happen and it's sad man it really is sad but I said before the season he probably wouldn't be an all-star. And I also said that I don't believe that it would be his fault by any means. So the truth hurts. It sucks. It's awful. It's not good. It's bad. What's some what's what's some other synonyms? I don't know some other synonyms for bad, but it's bad, all right? So I don't know. We'll see what happens um, going forward. Like people have said, you know, we do have more votes to come, but I will not be banking on that whatsoever. I don't see this happening. Um I I'm sorry, guys. But look, um, if you guys want to support the channel, as always, I want to go ahead and show you something really quickly. You can join um, the Discord. Yeah, all you have to do is go to the link in the description, have a group chat. And as always, we have about over 400 now. Uh, yeah, still close to 400. We have about 400 people in the group chat. So you can go and join that. And please, like, give your take. Uh, if you have any content that you want to suggest for me to do, you can put it in this tab over here. Or you can just check out some of the other things that I have listed, like video games, anime, memes, music, movies, show suggestions, all that good stuff. Um, but yeah, I, I just, I, like, I just want to say this, okay? I just want to say this. This is, I know that I stumbled over my words the entire video. I've been tired the last couple of days, but I do want to say something. You guys are really, 
really helping the channel. Everyone that's become a patron, everybody that's become a YouTube member already, you guys are really supporting the channel. And I just have to be honest, I really do appreciate it. Like, really, I really do appreciate it. So, um, but yeah, I, it just means the world to me. And I do have an announcement, but I'll, I'll make it in like next day or so. Um, it's going to be a giveaway prize that someone actually sent to me, and I'm pretty excited to give it away. Um, so, but yeah, you guys look, keep supporting the way you do, whether it be liking, subscribing, all that good stuff. And I'll give it to you guys later, man. Until next time, uh, deuces.